family of a man shot and killed by Metro Police earlier this week is demanding accountability. They say 43-year-old Brandon Durham was shot and killed unlawfully. My father always feared the police. And even, it went, even with that fear, he asked me to call the police. And when I grabbed my phone and I handed it to him, that was the last time I saw my father alive. The last time. After viewing body camera sh uh, footage of the shooting, the Durham family called the shooting a complete disservice, and now they're demanding justice for their family. So what happens now with the investigation? Fox 5 Investigates' Andriana Shepard takes a closer look at where this case goes next. Well, we learned 26-year-old Alexander Bookman is the officer involved in this incident. He served with Metro for about three years and is now on routine administrative leave. At this point, the investigation can go in several directions. If his actions are ruled unjustified, the district attorney can file charges and the case will go through the legal process. The shooting can be ruled justified and he'd return to his duties. If the DA doesn't file charges, Clark County will hold a public fact-finding review to explain why. That's the DA's office gives a presentation about the shooting, including witnesses, and an opportunity for people to ask questions. Officials aren't the only ones with power to make complaints. Witnesses to police misconduct can also file grievances with the Citizen Review Board. As for the suspected intruder, police arrested Alejandra Boudreau. She faces a number of charges, including willful or wanton disregard of safety of persons resulting in death. Andriana, thank you. And officers believe Boudreaux and Durham knew each other, and this was not a random act of violence.